right guys so welcome to today's um video it's been a long time i've actually uh, made a video for you guys so if you're one of my subscribers and say sorry for uh the long uh vacation actually i never planned it i never knew i was going to stay long i think almost a week now before I, uh since i uploaded a video tutorial so actually let's move forward and if you are a new subscriber on my channel my name is john anna Vulori. so yeah right channel where you can learn stuffs regarding to making money online and tutorials on how to set up systems to get things done for you online so today i want to share with you guys uh a simple uh stuff that anyone can actually use is actually i actually got a message on my whatsapp and someone asked for me um how can i know the current exchange rate on WhatsApp? now you've been following my channel i've done uh, i think i've done a video before about two videos on how you can use bata to make payments online you know for instance in my country i can use um there are some cards i can use uh to pay for some services which i use for instance i use skyview skyview to create my funnels to create for my mailing campaigns for some other stuffs i use um skyview i can uh, renew my subscription on skyview with my um regular uh local bank cards and it has been difficult for me to use my PayPal account to subscribe to renew my account on Kaiview. So I use Bata card to renew my subscription. And that's what I'm going to be showing you very soon how to go about that. So I use Bata card. So Bata card is a card you can use to pay for your online services, to buy products online. If you are finding it difficult to make payment with the PayPal or your regular local card, so you can use Bata to make payments. You can't use it to receive money online. You can't use it to receive uh, payments from your clients online. You can only use it to pick, uh, you know, payments online. You can actually use it to actually verify your PayPal accounts as well. So let me go over now and show you. Uh, okay, the question I was asked was, um, how can I know the actual exchange rate for Bata? So if you want to use Bata card and you've generated your card, I don't know if Bata works for other countries, but in my country, you need to first fund your account in naira so you have a card in naira as you can see and then you also fund an account you fund your account as well wow this is <laughs> i'm going to I actually want to fund about 24 dollars yet to pay for my uh so as for a service so i'm going to freeze this card once i'm done or i'm going to um, um i'm going to delete the card before i upload this video on because i'm not ready to use this five dollars and i'm still going to add 24 dollars more to if i can pay for what i want to use it for so now if you want to fund a card in dollars you can really fund your card in dollars so you just come over and then once you've created a new card you can always you know create the card use it and then and then you can you, know, you can actually freeze it or you can delete it you can see i can freeze the card or i can actually permanently delete it because i've not used it for once so i can delete it now but once i've used it for once then i can actually go ahead and delete it but i'm not going to freeze it now so i'm going to leave it open and so if i want to fund this card if you want to fund your card once you've created a new card you want to fund the card just click on the card you want to fund in dollars and then once you click on it it's going to bring up an interface for you you know to uh to for you to add up how much funds you want to uh fund on the card so let me just click on the card right now all right so just go ahead you're going to see uh, uh you'll see you can you can see a tab right there it says fund this card i don't want to fund this card i'll just go ahead and then click on fund this card so you can see it's going to pop up you know a small interface how much do you want to fund inside the dollar account so you can see i'm just going to input i want to fund 24 dollars i'm just going to write 24 dollars so you get the equivalent of the amount you're going to be charged so you can see i'm going to be charged 472 dollars per do 422 naira sorry per dollar as you can see this is very very high and actually that's why i don't want to fund my account for now because i don't know it's ridiculous it's too much ah, 472 naira per dollar that's too much so i'm just going to hold on so you can see i'm going to be paying 11,000 naira for uh 24 dollars so that's how you know the actual amount you're paying to fund your account what you need to do first is make sure you fund your first card your butter card this is your butter card you fund it in naira then once you fund your uh, your your Bata card in Naira, you can now head over to create a new card. If you don't have a dollar card already, you can create a new card. So once you create a card, you can then go ahead and fund the card. So once you click on fund the specific uh, dollar card, you will get the equivalent of the amount. So if you're going to fund hundred dollars, see that means you're going to be charged four hundred seventy two forty seven thousand two hundred Naira. So that means you have to fund at least. 47,200 naira inside your naira butter card so they can easily 
you know yeah you can easily get yeah, your hundred dollar credited inside your new card so that's how it works and that's how you get to know the actual exchange rate uh for uh exchange rate exchange rates on back on a butter platform so if you have any question for me you can drop it in the comment section below or if you don't want to ask on the comment section you can actually connect with me on facebook right here you can connect with me on facebook here we are going to connect with you and share you can we can connect together and uh you can actually send your message here and ask me one or two questions relating to online marketing with regards to digital marketing product launching affiliate marketing and actually building a profitable business online so thank you for watching and one more thing please you can just click on the subscribe button under this video subscribe to my channel and i really appreciate you doing that so thank you for watching my name is john anavi enjoy the rest of your day and um bye bye